Hi, everyone. I'm Mark Rosenthal with you on this Wednesday. We do have some changes coming in the weather department over the next several days. Nothing terrible, although I do think wet weather comes back for a time on Friday. Now, a couple of things I want to talk to you about in sports. Last night, the Red Sox beat Philly 2-1, to one, but the Yankees also win, so we keep our 10-game lead in first place. I'm comfortable with that. How about you? And, of course, tonight is Wednesday night. That means one thing only. Joanna Jethro Mills are back at Shoppers Cafe in Waltham for more karaoke. The fun there starts at 9 o'clock. Come on down. All right, let's get into it and see what we've got for you here, folks, with a forecast today being brought to you by Cape Cod Winery, located in Oxbow Road in East Falmouth. They have some of the most vintage, unique wines the Cape has to offer. This is a must-see when you're on the Cape. Call the Cape Cod Winery at 508-457-5592 online at capecodwinery.com. Let's check out the weather headline. It's a hot Wednesday, a beach day tomorrow. Shower storms move in on Friday and a 50-50 weekend in the offing the way it looks right now. So for today, partly sunny, hot, buggy, 85 to 90. Slight chance of a late day shower or thunderstorm. At the beach today, high tide in Boston Harbor, 311. Southwest wind sees 1 to 3 feet, water temps near 70. It's partly sunny and hot. It'll be 85 to 90 and still muggy. Cloudy skies, muggy of an eye, temperatures in the upper 60s, low 70s. And now here's your five day forecast starting with tomorrow. We're talking about sun clouds. It'll be hot. Temps 88, a little bit cooler at the coast. Friday, increasing clouds, showers and storms during the afternoon, mid 80s. And Saturday, showers could linger in the morning, maybe some improvement during the afternoon, mid 70s. Sunday, a beach day, sunshine 75 to 83. And Monday, partly sunny in the 80s, but a little bit cooler at the shore. So there you go. That's my forecast. Thanks for checking in. Please stay tuned for updates. I'm Mark Eisenthal.